Hi guys, it's time for learning with Little Tweet and Layton. It is Tuesday, the last day of March. Ooh, tomorrow is April 1st. Do you know what that means? Tomorrow is April Fool's Day. Uh-oh. I've played some pretty good tricks on Layton before, right? Right, Layton? <laughs> I have. <laughs> Maybe I'll tell you guys about those. Oops, you okay, Owen? Yeah. Owen's oh, skateboarding. Say hi. <laughs> okay, so let's get started. Um, Layton's gonna film me today, okay? Um, we are reading, let me pull it out. Sorry! Here's Avery. We're reading <laughs> King and Kayla and the case of the missing dog treats. I hope you like it. King and Kayla and the case of the missing dog treats. This is written by Dory Hillestad Butler illustrated by Nancy Myers. Chapter one, making peanut butter treats. Oh wait, we've read this before. We've read this before. <laughs> we've read this before, I forgot, but we'll read it again. <laughs> okay, hello, my name is King, I'm a dog. This is Kayla, she is my human. Kayla and I are making peanut butter treats. I love peanut butter treats. They're my favorite food. King thinks every food's his favorite food, right? Sorry, King, Kayla says. These treats aren't for you. My tail droops. They're for my friend Jillian, Kayla says. She just got a new puppy. Kayla stirs the flour, oatmeal, and baking powder. She adds milk, eggs, and peanut butter. Then she rolls out the dough. It smells so, so good. I wait for her to give me some of that dough. I wait and wait and wait. I can't wait anymore. I say, Kayla, please give me some of that dough. She looks at me. Do you wanna go outside, King? She asks. Because remember, she never understands what he's saying and she always thinks he wants to go outside because what he's saying to her sounds like this. Ow, 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 like that but he's really trying to tell her something, but she can't understand. No, I say, I want some dough. I'll take you outside in a little bit, Kayla says. She presses a cookie cutter into the dough. She lays the pieces of dough on a cookie sheet. Yeah, then she puts the cookie sheet in the oven. May I, I lick the bowl, I ask? Sorry. Great, baby. Sorry. It's okay. I know you want to lick the bowl, King, Kayla says, but you can't. Raw dough isn't good for dogs. She puts the bowl in the sink. My tail droops even lower. Ding! Kayla takes the treats out of the oven. She sets them on a wire rack to cool. Now we can go outside and play, Kayla says. Chapter two, intruder! Remember what intruder means? Intruder is like when someone comes into your space that's not welcome there, they're intruding. Kayla throws the ball. Go fetch, King, she says. Oh boy, I love to fetch. It's my favorite thing. I run, run, run after the ball. I bring the ball to Kayla. She throws it again. Hi, Kayla. Hi, King, calls a voice from the back porch. It's Kayla's friend, Jillian. Hi, Jillian, I call back. Jillian is not alone. This is Thor, she says. Hello, 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 says Thor. Thor has lots of energy. We run, we roll in the grass. Thor nips at my ears. Please don't eat my ears, I say. But Thor is just a baby. He giggles and nips at my ears again and again and again. Puppies do that sometimes, right? They like to kind of chew on things and play a lot. Sometimes it's hard to be the big dog. I need a drink of water, I tell Kayla. I also need a break from Thor. I run up the back stairs and into the house. Sniff, sniff. I smell an intruder. I don't see him, but I smell him. He stinks. I hear Kayla, Jillian, and Thor clomping up the steps. There's an intruder in the house, I tell Kayla. She and Jillian walk right past me. They go over to the treats. King, Kayla cries out. There are three missing treats. Did you take them? No, I say, but I don't think Kayla believes me. 
She looks at me like I'm a bad dog. I don't like it when Kayla thinks I'm a bad dog. How much time has, has it been, baby? Four. Oh, okay, cool. Chapter three, how to solve a case. <clears throat> I didn't take the treats, I tell Kayla. I look at Thor. He and Jillian came through the kitchen on their way to the backyard. Maybe Thor took them. I want my treats, I want my treats, Thor cries. Of course, it just sounds like, like that. But maybe, I bet, um, King understands them, right? Because they speak the same dog language. But um, how can uh, Kayla understand King? They don't. Kayla, the, the humans don't understand the dogs. It just sounds like barking. Thor cries. He leaps at the counter, but he's too short to reach the treats. So I don't think he took them. Sniff, sniff. I still smell that intruder. Maybe the intruder took the treats. Sit, King, Kayla says. I don't want to sit. Let's find the intruder, I tell yeah. Kayla. Kayla I doesn't understand. It. King, she says. I told you to sit. She makes mad eyes at me. I don't like it when Kayla makes mad eyes at me. I sit. I didn't take the treats, I say again. Kayla sniffs my face. She opens my mouth and looks inside. Thor looks too. I don't think King took the treats, Kayla says. I wag my tail. How do you know, Jillian asks. His breath doesn't smell like peanut butter, Kayla says. Kayla is a good detective. If, if he didn't take them, who did, Jillian asks. We'll find out, Kayla says. She grabs a notebook and pencil. Let's make a list of everything we know about this case, she says. Number one, there are three missing treats. Number two, King was in the kitchen. Number three, King's breath doesn't smell like peanut butter. If I could write, I would add this to Kayla's list of things we know. There's an intruder in the house. Now, let's make a list of what we don't know about this case, Kayla says. Number one, was anyone else in the kitchen? Number two, who else likes peanut butter treats? And number three, who else could have taken the treats? If I could write, I would add this to Kayla's list of things we don't know. Who is the intruder? Where is the intruder? Did the intruder take the treats? Now we need a plan, Kayla says. I have a plan. Find the intruder. Chapter four, clues. Follow me, I tell Kayla, Jillian, and Thor. I put my nose to the ground. Sniff, sniff, what baby? Ah, stop. Are you looking for clues, King? Kayla asks. Yes, I say. Hey, baby, stop. Yes, I say. I follow the intruder's scent from the back door to the counter. Hey, what's this? I ask. It's a bit of toast. I love toast. It's my favorite food. I gobble up the toast. Then I follow the intruder's scent from the counter to the hallway. Hey, what's this? I ask. It's a bit of peanut butter treat. I love peanut butter treats. They're my favorite food. I gobble up the, oh no, that bit of peanut butter treat was a clue. You shouldn't eat clues. I follow the intruder's scent from the hallway to the living room. Kayla's mom, Jillian's mom, and Jillian's little brother are there. They are not intruders. Kayla tells her mom about the missing treats. Hmm, her mom says. She looks at me. King didn't take them, Kayla says. His breath doesn't, wow. His breath doesn't smell like peanut butter. Did you see anyone go into the kitchen? Do you know what could have taken the treats or who could have taken the treats? The moms shake their heads. Come back here, Adam, Jillian's mom says. She picks up Jillian's little brother. Adam cries. Maybe Adam took the treats. Hey, what's this? I ask. It's hair. It's a hair. A gray hair. In fact, I count one, four, two, eight, six gray hairs. Remember, he's not very good at counting, right? No one here has gray hair. I follow the hairs to the couch. I peer under it. To peer is like to peek, to peek under it. Two yellow eyes peer back at me. How much time, baby? Nine. Okay. 
chapter five, case closed. Intruder, intruder, I bark. The intruder is eating Thor's treats under the couch. I need to chase him away. I need to rescue the treats, but I don't fit under the couch. Ha ha, the intruder laughs at me. Mm. What's the matter, King? Jillian asks. She and Jillian look under the couch. It's a cat, Jillian says. Where did he come from? Oh, I see, hold on, baby, hold on. He must have come in when the back door was open, Kayla says. I paw at the cat, but I can't reach him. Ha ha, the cat laughs at me again. I need help, and I know who can help me. Thor, he is small enough to fit under the couch. The cat lets out an angry yowl and zooms out into the living room. Thor and I chase him through the kitchen and out the back door. Kayla closes the door behind him. You were right, Kayla, Jillian says. King didn't steal the treats, that cat did. Bad cat, I say. Good boy, King, Kayla says. You solved the case of the missing treats. You are the king of crime solving. And you are the queen, I say. Jillian gives Thor a peanut butter treat. Kayla gives me a piece of cheese. Oh boy, I love cheese. It's my favorite food. The end. So I know we've read that before, but I hope you enjoyed listening to it again. The reason why I picked this book is because We've been talking about the ing chunk, and King has the ing chunk, right? Um, okay, guys, come on back for part two of learning with a little tweet. The little tweet says, good job, everybody. Bye.